Well, this is a fine beginning to this channel. I have something going on in my right throat area. It is freezing in here in southern Alabama with freak 20 degree Fahrenheit temperatures. And as a Virgo, I'm experiencing all kinds of digestive problems, possibly augmented by the current moon phase. Even so, I know I am, and I count myself very, very blessed. Excuse me. Let's start the day with a prayer my wife and I love to do every morning. Thank you, Spirit, for surrounding us with love and light, for protecting us from those who would do us harm, and guiding us on our path for our greater good. Thank you, we love you, and so it is. Blessed be. I have found that it is very important to always start every day with a verbalized expression of gratitude. Uh, for those of you who are new to the channel, I was an agnostic atheist until a profound spiritual experience in 2013 changed all that. Since then, I have dedicated my life as one of service to others. This channel is one way I am contributing to the world. Here you will find videos that run the gamut of interests, though mostly in the spiritual and metaphysical realms. Life is composed of light and dark, and both are essential to our universe. Therefore, although I know it will turn some off, in order to be authentic to myself, my inner guidance, and the message I'm here to share, I will do my best to cover both aspects. Some of the lighter topics I'll cover are angels and angel messages, fairyology and nature spirits, law of attraction and manifesting, Bible and scripture meanings, the gospel of Jesus of Nazareth, holistic natural and herbal healing, diet and nutrition, prophets and prophecies, animals and pets, and good works of the Christian church. Now, I am not a doctor, uh, and nothing I say on this channel should be construed as medical advice. It is all simply my opinion and should be taken with a grain of salt. Always verify any information from any source and check with your trusted physician or naturopathic caregiver, spiritual leader, and inner guidance before applying it in your own life. And yes, I'm reading a script because I haven't, <laughs> I can't, haven't quite learned how to do it without a script yet. Uh, when I say dark topics, I'm talking about those traditionally considered taboo in Judeo-Christian society, um, including those dealing with human sexuality, power and control, domination and enslavement, what Swedish psychologist Carl Jung called shadow work, the dark night of the soul, monsters, aliens, secret societies, etc. Some specific dark areas we will deal with are witches and witchcraft, the science of foul language, curses and spellcasting, demonology and exorcism, bad deeds by the Christian church, good deeds by Muslims, the Quran, integration of ego, mind control, propaganda, and MK Ultra, Ouija and spirit communication, divination methods, sexual magic, Satanism and the Temple of Set, Neo-paganism and earth-based spirituality, Bigfoot, Sasquatch, Chupacabra, and other cryptids, victim mentality versus owning your own truth, werewolves, vampires, mummies, and other movie monsters, true history of the Illuminati, ancient alien theory, time travel and quantum theory, Atlantis, Lemuria, and the Irish origins of civilization, the Aryans, gods, goddesses, deities, and other pantheons. Uh, ancient Celtic spirituality, shamanism, the origins of our holidays, the many saviors that predate Jesus, archetypes and the hero's journey, ancient European cultures, ancient African cultures and heroes, slavery among all nations and races. How many genders are there really? 
Big Brother versus Personal Sovereignty, Solutrians, Sami, and Similarities Between Native Americans and Celtic Peoples, and much, much more. Now, this channel is founded on authenticity and integrity. As such, we will not mince words here. Though I am well educated and will not normally use profanity, it will happen from time to time that profanity is expressed. Additionally, Though I will do my best to avoid causing harm to anyone, I will always speak my mind. In real life, there is a good chance that someone is going to be offended, no matter what you say. That is the reality that we live in. We aim here to speak openly with compassion. And yes, I know there are those who don't believe in free speech anymore and who think you should have trigger warnings for everything. Well, let me tell you this. You do nobody any favors by shielding them from the truth. Thus, as I am not inclined to be disingenuous, there will be very few, if any, trigger warnings on this channel. I believe we should each be free to be you and me, and that personal expression is the key to letting the world know who we are, what choices we've made in life, and what we believe our purpose to be. Who knows? Maybe this channel will eventually become so popular that COINTELPRO tro trolls posing as social justice warriors will get everyone to try to boycott us. But alas, we can only hope for that kind of fame and free publicity. So then, if you are the type of person who freaks out or is offended at profanity, or free speech for that matter, this is probably not the channel for you. There are many other good spiritual channels where the hosts do not cuss or use profanity or discuss dark topics, and there is nothing wrong with that. Some of the channels I'd recommend for your tastes are Infinite Waters, Angel Souls, and Doreen Virtue. Still here? Great! Then you are declaring that you are a truth seeker, have an open mind, and are able and willing to think critically about any information you receive, making your own determination of what to keep based on what resonates and what doesn't. Thank you for joining me on this journey. This is going to be... Well, <laughs> this is going to be... An informative, entertaining, and provocative adventure. In the spirit of learning, love, and authentic exploration of hidden truths, I christen this channel Officially Launched. Oh, and be sure to watch the first episode of Light Wolf Speaks, starting where you are. Maybe up here or over there in the corner when I figure that out. Namaste. Mitakue Oyasin, love and blessings to all, and have a miraculous day.